Hey guys, so um, right now I can tell that my voice is really weird and I have a sore throat right now. So I'm sorry about that and um, setup's a little bit different. I just decided to do it this way and I actually like it. So, and I don't know why I'm wearing a red lip. I have no idea. I put on a pink top. I'm not feeling it so I was just like whatever. I'm just going to put this on and now I look whiter than crap. But I, I am white, so why does it matter? I don't know. But anyways, as you can tell by the title, I am showing you what came in the Violet Box box. I already opened it, did a video on it, and didn't like it. And I deleted it. I should have kept it because I didn't have a sore throat then when I filmed it, which was yesterday. So I woke up like this. So you're going to periodically see me drink my tea right there. Um, because... I just need to. But let's go ahead and get started. Um, I have used one of the products so far, and yeah, I will tell you which one it is and my thoughts on it for right now, um, and just look for upcoming reviews on these products. Um, but this is what the box looks like, and if you don't know what Influencer is, basically if you just like to give reviews or if you're a YouTuber or a blogger, um, check out Influencer. Uh, dot com because they will send you little box boxes if you do enough reviews and all of that um, periodically throughout the year I've gotten this is my second box this year last or last time I got it it was the sweetheart box box um, if you want to see it you can check it out down below um, and it was just a little white box with a heart on it this one's purple because it's the violet box box as what you could tell by the title um, I'm thinking this video, since I'm filming it on a Thursday, Friday, it will probably go up on Sunday, um, just so you know. But anyway, let's go ahead and get into the box. And there is one, actually I've tried two things, because one of them was a food item, and I already ate it, and I can give you a quick review on that right now. Um, but yeah, so it's the Violet Vox Box. If you want to check that out any, on by anybody else that has received it on YouTube or on a blog, just Google that. And if you can find out what their opinions are. But that little sheet is just telling you how much the items cost. And I will go through that in a second with you guys. Is that a sippy sippy? Oh my gosh, I almost fell. Okay, sorry. Okay. So the first item is the Montagene Junessi face mask. I don't ever know how to pronounce this name, so I'm sorry it was wrong the way I said it. Um, but if you want to check it out, they have mjclayspa.com down here if you want to check out their products. They sell them at Target, at Walmart. They are really inexpensive. The one that I'm going to be able to try out for you guys is the Red Earth Clay Spa um, and this is has real clay and pomegranate and cinnamon scent in it. So it looks like this. They're just those little face masks. So you apply it to your face. You leave it on for about, what does it say? 10 to 15 minutes and you take it off. This one is supposed to, I think it's a deep clean I read unbelievable deep cleanse so yeah it's just gonna help deep clean your face I'm really excited about this because I've never tried this clay mask before and I don't really remember trying other when me I have I don't really remember what they were um but I have tried from their brand this retails for $2.49 but they even you know if you don't want to try out this one because you don't like pomegranate definitely go check out the ones that are like a dollar forty nine because they were very inexpensive and they work very good very nicely but I'm not sure about that one yet so I just stay on my channel and you'll figure it out sooner or later I'll have a review coming up and then I have this goodie athletic um ouchless head wrap it just looks like this it's just a band for your hair and this one's reversible and the fabric is quick dry so this side you have gray and a trim of purple and on the other side you just have purple so looks like this. I'm excited because um, I've been wanting to try like a thicker band in my hair to see what it would look like and I just never buy them. This retails for, let me grab the card and find out, $6. So yeah, 
dollars for this and it's quick dry so if you work out and you're sweating it will dry quick <laughs> um and then this product that they sent me oh my gosh um, is not your mother's clean freak refreshing dry shampoo you get instant results and this absorbs excess oils cleanses without water and gives you a light matte finish so it looks like this I think this is the travel size I would assume so it's only uh, 1.6 ounces but I'm not sure but that's actually a good amount of product to try out I actually used this product this morning because I don't know why my hair looks oily but I took a shower yesterday and I like the scent of it right on my hand it just smells nice and clean and I really like that about this just kind of reminds me of like your clean laundry that's how the fragrance is and this also shows up white so if you do have darker hair um, I would recommend to just you know make sure to blend it in you know by brushing it throughout your hair and stuff like that but um, right now it's pretty good product I guess I didn't have any oil on my skin but if there's oil the oil turns white so just remember that and the product that I was super, super, super excited about, oh, actually, let me get to this. This was, this retails for full size, let me find it, $5.99. And I don't know if it's, like, the full size or what. So I don't know. This could be the full size, I'm not sure. But if it is, that's cool. Anyways, this is the product that I'm so, so excited about. You guys know I love nail polish, anything nails. I'm going to school to be a nail technician. And I got a Triple Shine Sally Hansen nail polish in here. I know my mom had bought me two for Christmas, but obviously they're for Christmas and it's not Christmas. So I can't try them out or anything yet. Um, like I did open the bottle, but I never swatched them or anything. And I was so excited. I know I didn't purchase this color because the colors that I purchased were like in the blue family. Um, but I know Dulce County 87, they sent her some of these for a review. And she really liked this light green one. And so far, I'm pretty sure I picked out all sparkles. Um, and this one is a sparkle that was given to me. This is in the um, color Dream Sequins, if you can see it. And it's just a really pretty coppery shade, and it's a dupe for the um, Sephora by OPI Don't Be Egg Noxious, except this one is fine glitter, and that one was medium glitter. Um, but how it works is you just take off this lid, because you're like, well, this lid is kind of awkward. No, it's not. And if you guys know the Salon, Sally Hansen 5-in-1 um, Salon Manicure um, bottles, well, product. Um, it's got the same brush. Do you see, like, that same brush that's curved at the bottom so you can get to the cuticle area and all of that. So, I'm really excited about this product because I've been wanting to try it. And it's, like, the perfect rose goldy coppery shade. I love it. These retail for, let me check here, guys, $4.99. And this is a full size. Um, and then there was one more item in here. By the way, these are supposed to be these available in 30 shades and daily defense from water and wear and they'll get you'll get the shiniest nails ever. Um, and then the next thing that they sent was a Soy Joy bar. Mine was in the flavor cranberry and when I first tried it last night I was like oh my gosh this is so good but let me tell you I was starving so then when I had another bite after I had eaten because uh, I saved some for the video to show you guys what it looked like. No. I didn't like it. On the package it said it was a moister and fruitier or something like that. I don't know what the heck it was before, but it was not moist at all. Um, I like Fig Newtons, but this thing, I thought at first it tasted like a Fig Newton. But then when I took a second bite later on, when I wasn't as hungry, it tasted kind of bad. So... I don't really like it. They retail for 99 cents, maybe in a different flavor or something, but it was kind of dry, and I just didn't really care for it. Um, but it had like 4 grams of protein in it, there was 18 carbs, 12 sugars, and I think it was like 140 calories for the whole bar, and it wasn't really a satisfying bar, so I didn't even eat the whole thing. I gave the rest to my dad. 
But anyway, that's everything that I got in my Vox box. Um, just look for the upcoming reviews of all of these products. Each one will have a separate video. And I will see you guys later in my vlog because I am vlogging today since I have a day off from school because we don't have school because of the ice storm that we're getting. So anyways, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!